Hello guys, welcome here to our channel, Claude and Jessica live in Philippines, currently, currently in, in Texas. Texas. Can you talk about the hats? No. Anyways, yeah, house and lot in the Philippines, someone asked me to do a vlog on it, and there isn't too much I know, but I just know our particular lot was given to her by her papa. Yeah, right? my papa. Yeah, he extended it a little bit, I think it's 20 by 18 or whatever. That's not a big spot, but it's good enough. We have a two-story home there. Um, when you buy a house a lot, you just need to be careful for certain things, right? Yes. My wife's gonna tell you what those things are. Babe, wait, I'm blocked. She's having a block right now in her brain. <laughs> you know what's been. Well, I was like looking Of course you want to, you know, I, I didn't do much research. You need to find out, make sure they have the deed for the property. Oh, yes, yes. That everything is legitimate. And, uh, mm. Never mm. hand over any money until you know those things. And, uh, yeah, well, you want to make it sure that move the head. property is legit. Yes, for sure, because you yeah. don't want to get into no scams or nothing, right? Yes, babe? yes. And the uh, property where I live in Bukidnon is really cheap. Yeah, in yeah, Maramaya. Yeah, there's area. like a lot of properties selling in Marama and Quezon. It's really cheap though. I'm going to, yeah. Yeah. Yeah, so I mean, um, and if you start building, and I we talked about this before in the past, like even when we started building our house in 2020, I kept asking, is there a building permit? Because in the States, you need to have that before you even start building. Check the zoning laws and all that stuff. But we found out after, you know, we were there in the Philippines, um, there was oh. building permit, but it's a little bit different there. Uh -oh. Our daughter's tired. You have to do that and make sure... Like, even her grandmother owned the street in front of her house. Yes. She donated, actually. She donated, street. but you have to pay a certain amount. Otherwise, they could actually take part of your house from you or something, right? Yes, yeah. Like, that happened to her aunt, right? Mm-hmm. And yeah, like, my aunt from Ibanda. Yeah, so she had, she had to move part of her property or whatever mm -hmm. it was. But we paid half of our tax, and then the other half, I don't know, months later... But we're all set. The blueprints made. Yeah, we pay like um, oh six hundred uh, thirty thousand pesos. Yeah, thirty thousand pesos for, for our building permit. Before I don't really know that one because I built my tiny house. I didn't pay for a building permit. It's just a small and tiny house, but I don't have any idea. That so as we were saying, um, oh, the building permit. You know, it's got to be done or there could be a problem with the, the zoning as far as that. <coughs> but it's not like here in the States, like zoning laws are crazy. It could be commercial area. You can't have any stores or nothing like that. Yeah, but before that one, usually the municipality go in the barangay and check the houses who has a building for me or who doesn't have any. And then they will tell the owner of the house, hey, you need to pay the building for me and this stuff. And they give you time. Yeah, they give you time. It's not like rushing, but you have to pay the building permit. Yeah, yeah, yeah. exactly. And uh, we're so excited about our, our property, our home. And, uh, Finally! We've been planning this one for a long time, but, you know, it takes for a while that we stop continuing um, building our house because we live here. It's kind of tough. We have our own bills here to pay. Yeah. Plus, we have to do continue the house, so it takes time, you know. Now I'm working, but it's still we still have bills to pay in here, so it's not like oh, actually yeah. like okay, send all the money there and finish the house. No, we can't no, do no, that because we have time. to live here too. We have our own expenses. We have for the babies needs to buy some stuff. You know, we have bills to pay, electric bills, rent and stuff. So yeah, and our goal here is to. When this lease is up, is to try to find some property to get a small house on property or whatever. There's a lot of deals down here in yeah, South Texas. Yeah, but for now, that's our plan. That's the plan is to have our own here. Yeah. Then we can spend six months, six months there, whatever it is. You know, somebody said the other night on the, on the, on the channel, like, hopefully you get to live there someday. Well, we already have lived there. 
Yeah, we're just here in Texas now because the immigration laws. I choose, we choose to be here because yeah. I know that we're going to have our kids. Right, she's a permanent resident, you know, and she wants to keep that until she becomes a We want to be citizen. in the Philippines, so we'll miss the Philippines, oh, yeah. right, babe? But just sometimes we have, we can't think about, like, enjoying stuff. We have to save money for our kids. Kids are growing now and yeah, it's more important. stuff that we need to buy for them, you know, preparing for their future, so... But we're yeah, gonna so. go there visit and stuff because of course I'm working. We can stay there for a long time, same as before. But yeah. we get a plan to visit while baby girls plane tickets free. <laughs> yeah, but make sure you do your research on that. This isn't too much information, but like her a lot was given to her. We were gonna get by a lot in Merrimack, but it turned out good because her mom helped out. Uh, her uncle built the house. Yeah. And, uh, but that's it. I just wanted to mention these things and pray for us that everything goes smooth. They're going to be putting ceilings in and closing the roof. And then we're going to go on to tiles, I think, right? Yes. Tiles and cabinets. Uh, a few Mom, things like that. Medicine, okay? Well, we kind of got our hands full. Our All right, we have to go because need to take good care of two little ones here. Okay, we have a wonderful, blessed weekend. And right. we love you guys. Marine, Marine, Salamat. I'm Ping. Babe, can you give me?